Well, lives can change in an instant, good or bad. One little 10 year old boy's life may have changed for good after he met a very caring Millersville police officer. Andy Cordan has the story that you will only see on News 2. This story begins on Saturday. A Millersville police officer is in this neighborhood. He comes upon some boys who are riding bicycles and one 10 year old who's running alongside those boys who are riding their bikes. I asked him why he was chasing me. He told me he didn't have a bike. When Millersville police officer Jonathan Lassiter sees a 10 year old boy without a bike, this cop who grew up around here knows he has to act. I remember being a kid riding bikes, having fun. It just looked like he'd have more fun if he was riding with them instead of chasing them. Lassiter and other members of the force pool their money. And that very afternoon, they deliver the bike to the excited little boy. They had a green one, but I like blue better because I drive a Ford. I totally like that. That is an awesome color of blue. I, I like blue better too. I love it. Well, there you go, little man. Thank you. Now you don't have to chase your friends no more. <laughs> Just doing it to make somebody smile. See, see him have a good day. Lassiter says behind his badge, I feel good. There's a heart full of happiness. He stated to me that he thought about being a police officer. When I was a kid, that's what I wanted to be. So maybe this will help him encourage him to be a police officer when he gets older. Julie Inman tells News 2. Oh, I think it's awesome. It, it actually it really put a smile on my son's face. So the magnanimous gesture has made a huge impact on her son. He's not stopped riding it since. He loves it. I, I try to do everything for the community. That's a pretty cool thing, isn't it? Absolutely. It was awesome that he done that. I, I was raised here. I mean, this is where I spent my whole life. Yes, he gets to ride and play with the neighborhood kids now, so I greatly appreciate it. Just a good image and to know that we're here doing good things. This story has already generated some good vibes out in the community. An anonymous donor has already dedicated more than a dozen bicycles to the police department for situations just like this. In Millersville, Andy Cordan, News 2.